This movie tells a story about five military veterans who are also best friends. They are gathering to support their troubled host who recently lost his wife. It will be sooner than later that the metaphoric ghosts of their past become all too literal. First of all, this movie is less a supernatural horror and more a tale about what individually haunts us and a philosophical argument about person's inability to find peace. The large portions of the movie seem to forget that we're in a ghost story. It's not really a problem in itself, just do not expect anything remotely close to pure conventional horror movie. Most of the movie takes place in one place, which means the dialogue has to be superb as it's the one that really has to drive the film. That's one problem of the movie, sometimes the dialogue works but sometimes not so much. The script leans on long monologues, reminiscence, and judgments which don't really deliver suspense or thrills. The wartime metaphors and motifs are ever-present, but the story doesn't really hit home the point it's trying to make. There are debates and discussions about several interesting themes, but they are not exactly novel or deep. There are a lot of ideas juggling around in this movie, as the movie seems confused what the focus should be. The cast are all fantastic and their acting is very good. Unfortunately, not all the characters come across as fully realized. The cast does what it can with the material, but the script often feels overwrought and sometimes repetitive. Occasionally, the movie is using clumsy means to convey information as well. The movie has some moments popping with a supernatural infusion, while others focusing on more philosophical and ideological themes. These tonal shifts and uneven narrative keep it from feeling as impactful as it could be. Eventually, after so much build up, it becomes abrupt and closed off, leaving little room for a proper resolution. Overall, it's not really worth to watch this movie in theaters. Just wait on your streaming service.